our devotion is on the Revelation chapter 5. Yesterday we were on Revelation chapter 4 regarding about heaven. Eh? So today I think we are still in heaven. Okay? Based on this chapter. Let's pray. Father in heaven, we thank you, Lord, for your word this morning, even as we continue to study about your word, Father. We pray you help us understand your word. May it come alive. In Jesus' name, Amen. Okay, read. Angel, a very strong 
So we do not know what the name of the angel are. So far we only know the names of two angels in here, I believe. One is Angel Gabriel and one is Angel Michael. Ah, I have not read any other about some of the Catholics, they also believe in one more angel called Raphael. But in the in the, our Bible we don't have this angel. So, but anyway, this angel is not mentioned, but it's a mighty, very big angel, and he announced in a loud voice, who is worthy to break the seals and open the scroll? So this is a very special scroll, huh? scroll, okay? And uh, nobody can, have the, nobody come forward to open it, okay? Nobody, heaven also none, earth also none, and also what? The world below, the world below, that means, what is the world below? That means there's a world under earth, la. right? Right, heaven, earth, then world below. Is it hell? Maybe more than hell, huh? Anna, that's the world below. They also don't know what the world below. Okay, anyway, there's nobody able to open it. And what happened is that John started crying. He was crying in heaven. Anyone of you crying before? I think so, right? You'll cry, huh? Okay, your parents beat you, you cry, huh? But he cried for something, huh? He cried because nobody can open the seal, mm. uh, the roll, huh? Okay, so he was crying, okay? And uh, because nobody was worthy. Then later, an elder came. How many elders was there? We read. There are 24 elders, huh? We don't know which elder came forward. It's not mentioned. And he said, oh, don't cry, John. There's somebody who can, has the word who's worthy. Who's that somebody? Jesus actually, yeah. because why is it lion from the Judah's tribe, the great descendant of David? All these refer to Jesus. Jesus is from the tribe of Judah. Okay, Jesus is a descendant of David. Okay, who has won the victory? Jesus won the victory mm -hmm. over death. Anna, he was resurrected from the dead. Jesus won the victory. Okay, therefore Jesus is the one who can. He, only Jesus has the ability. Okay. So then they saw a lamb. Oh, the lamb also refers to Jesus. Ah, no, Jesus is the lamb of God. Remember? Uh, so the lamb also refers to Jesus. Standing in the center. So actually Jesus is there in heaven. He's together at the, at the center of the throne. He's not mentioned as sitting there. But he, he may be standing or what. We're not, not sure. Okay? But he was at the, at the lamb. Surrounded by the four leaders. So Jesus is in the center. Okay? And he appeared to have been killed. I don't know how he appeared to have been killed. Maybe... Maybe the lamb, maybe it looks like an actual lamb, you know, okay? So, it appeared to have been killed and it had seven. So, it's not, it's a symbol, eh? okay? Seven head. Okay, a lamb with seven head and with seven eyes. Okay? The seven eyes represent the angels. Seven, not angels, the seven spirits. So, always a lot of time we read the eyes represent the spirit. Huh? Why? Because the spirit can see through. Huh? Okay, this spirit is sent all over the whole earth. But of course, Jesus has the Holy Spirit. I believe this spirit is uh, another seven spirit. We read, we read about the seven spirit huh? when he talked to the, to the churches, the seven church, every church, one spirit. Huh? Okay, so then the Lamb is the one who went, took the scroll from the right hand of the one who is so called from the Father. And when he did so, what happened? All the living creatures, the four living creatures, and the 24 elders, they, they were actually holding a harp and a bowl. Harp, that's what they call a harp and bowl ministry. What is harp and bowl? Harp and bowl ministry, sometimes you heard in church, eh? harp means you play, play with the song. That means you're worshiping God. The bowl means what? Bowl refers to prayer. In this case, the bowl is the prayer of the saints. So we believe that when we pray to God, okay, all our prayer actually is collected by God in heaven above, in a bowl. Of course, maybe not literally in a bowl, I mean, maybe representative. But what we mean is that all our prayers is collected by God. And in heaven, there's... So very important in heaven now is worship and prayer. The worship represents the... Ha, ha. Then the bowl represents the prayer. So worship and prayer. And they were they were they were praying and they fell fell down before and they sang a song. Ha, ha. So in heaven as one thing we know there was a lot of songs sung. Okay? And this is a new song. Of course now we learn already uh, this song. Ha, ha. Because the Bible tells us. Uh, and some people make a song of this. Okay? 
You are worthy to take a scroll and to break open his seals. You were killed. Ah, Jesus was killed. Okay? By your sacrificial death. Jesus died for us on, on the cross. Huh? And bought your people. Jesus actually purchased us by the blood. By his own blood. Huh? He died for us. He purchased us. The word is called redemption. Huh? We use the word redemption. In the, old, in the Old Testament, when you want to... You have to purchase. You want to set the slave free, you have to pay money. Okay? Somebody must pay to buy you back. Nah, nah, let's say your soul as a slave. I will buy you. I must pay for you. That's called redemption. So Jesus used his own blood to buy us. Buy us from where? Pay for our sins. Nah, nah. What is the penalty of sin? Is death. Eternal death. So Jesus actually died for us so that we don't need to die. Okay? We are actually belong to Jesus. Okay, again I look. Okay, he have made them a kingdom of priests to serve our God. So, so God, by his death, God has purchased every tribe, language, nation. Not so, not only the Jews, not only Chinese, not only Indians, not only Africans, but every tribe. So we must, that's the, that's the perfect unity. Like only one way the, the world can be united through, Jesus, through the blood of Jesus. We are all purchased by God. All the tribes. To be a kingdom of priests to serve our God. So be a kingdom of kings and priests. That's why I say kings and priests. Because here we are priests. What's the function of priests? Priests mostly is to pray. Huh? Prayer. King is mostly to rule. So we are also going to rule with Christ and also to pray and worship. You see? Kingdom of priests to serve our God and they shall rule on earth. So we are also kings and priests. King to rule and priests to worship God. So one more time, they look and I, then, oh, now you see a lot of angels in heaven. Earlier, not so many angels are there, right? We read a few angels only now, we read about thousands and millions of them. And they were all around the throne and they were worshipping, singing. The lamb who was killed is worthy to receive power. So God is worthy to receive what? Power, wealth, wisdom and strength, honor. Glory and praise. So you have uh, any highlighter, you can highlight these words. Right now. The lamb who was king was worthy to receive power, wealth, wisdom, strength, honor, glory, and praise. Seven, if you have come properly, eh? Anna. Power, wealth, wisdom, strength, honor, glory, and praise. So God is worthy to receive all this. Okay? Then he heard another creature in heaven. No, heard every creature in heaven, on earth, and in the world below, and in the sea. All living and they were all for everybody was singing. So you can imagine how loud the sound is. Everyone was singing in heaven on earth, under the under the earth. To him who sits on the throne, to the Lamb, be praise, honor, glory, and might forever and ever. And the four living creatures, okay, the four living creatures, they can sing and they can talk. Right? They sing now, they say what? Amen. That's why they always say amen. Amen means what? Yes, we agree. Ah, so be it, let it happen. Okay? And all the welders fell down and worship. So you can see very wonderful uh, picture of heaven. Ah, worship. So this is gonna happen in the future. Okay, the seals and all that we'll read later. Okay, the next chapter. What is inside the scroll? So let's pray. Father in heaven, we thank you for your word. Thank you for this wonderful scene we see in heaven, Lord. And we pray, Father, that all of us, oh God, will be worthy, Lord. And we know we are worthy because once we believe in Jesus, Jesus actually uh, bought us with his blood so that we are worthy. But we can only be worthy if we rely on the blood of Jesus. For, for those who have yet to believe in Jesus, we pray for them, Lord, that they also may be worthy through Jesus to believe for God. Therefore, Father, we thank you for today. Praise you. Thank you, Lord, for dying for us and redeeming us with your precious blood. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen.